so in this video i'm going to show the solution to question 12 which is a equation on approximations uh, the question reads elena measured the length of a line to be 2.2 centimeters if the actual length is 2 centimeters find the a absolute error b percentage error so to work out the first part which is uh, finding the absolute error we just have to look at the values given the first measure is 2.2 and this is the measured length so elena measured the length of the line as 2.2 and then the actual length is two centimeters so meaning here there are two measures there's a measured value and uh, the actual length the actual length also means the true value so absolute error is just the difference between the measured value and the actual length or the true value so if the true value so a true value is given as two centimeters then it means that the measured value is equal to 2.2 .2 centimeters absolute error is just a difference of this value and this value of course there's an application of uh, modulus to avoid getting a negative when you're uh, subtracting the two values so absolute error the formula is absolute error is equal to modulus so measured value minus true value and what this gives is if you substitute where there's measured value you put 2.2 centimeters then take away true value which is 2 centimeters the difference between these two values is just 0 0.2 centimeters so this here is a, our absolute error we can denote this as a e a E A E. So absolute error is equal to 0 0.2 centimeters. Uh, we now go to the second part of the question, which is finding the percentage error. So to work out part B of this question, what we're just going to do first is uh, calculate the relative error. So B relative error now the relative error is given by the formula absolute error over true value now in this case i'm going to denote absolute error as a e then over true value as t v t dot v so what we have on top is absolute error then below this is true value so relative error which i'll also denote here as r e equal to the absolute error we calculated in the first part was 0 0.2 then the true value given is the actual length which is two centimeters so what we just have to do is simplify this what we can do is just multiply this by 10 because of the one decimal place that is there and also balance it up below multiplying by 10 and uh, what we get on top is a whole number so r e equal to when you multiply 0 0.2 times 10 you get a 2 then 2 times uh, 10 we get a 20 so to change this to a decimal number we look for a number that can go into 2 and uh, 20 
and that is just a 2 so 2 into 2 1 2 into 20 that's a 10 how many times can 10 go into 1 it's 0 so point uh, you add a 0 to this 1 becomes a 10 10 into 10 that's a 1 so from 20 into 2 we get a 0 0.1 so now the percentage error percentage error is just equal to the relative error that we calculated multiplied by 100 so relative error that we got multiplied by 100% and what this is going to give us is percentage error is equal to the relative error is 0 0.1 multiply this by 100 percent what are we getting here if you move a point to the right you simplify one zero so meaning that here we've got 1 times 10 and 1 times 10 just gives us a, a 10 so what this means is that the percentage error is equal to 10 percent well that's it for this question where we were required to calculate the absolute error and the percentage error Thank you so much for watching the video.